Hey guys, Epic Jones here, and you can tell by the title of this video, we are about to have there. We are about to watch the Thunderbirds Lego Series 2 trailer. Now, because my channel's been a bit more Thunderbirds related, seeing as I actually make videos on Thunderbirds now, I thought I'd do something similar to what FAB Animations did and watch the trailer, and then I'm gonna give you like I'm gonna analyze it and stuff. Now, um, so essentially, we're gonna get the video up, uh, and then we're just gonna we're just gonna watch in its full. Now, if you're thinking, Harry, why why isn't it on yet? Why are you wasting time? Well, it's not actually twelve o'clock yet. It's eleven fifty nine. So I'm just anxiously waiting for the trailer to pop up in my subscription box. For ten seconds until it should be here. I'm actually really excited now because I love Thunderbirds. I'm not sure what we're going to expect. We know we've got that new guy called the Mechanic. Um, and there's going to be... We, there's a theory that suggests that Thunderbird 4 is going to blow up. Okay, we should have the new trailer any second now. <gasps> okay, it's here. It's here. It's here. It's here. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Go. Oh. Oh my god. Okay, this is very... Oh my... Crikey! Oh my god. Oh, it, he's back. Forgot his name. That was the Thunderbirds hat. The old one. Thunderbird 3 again. That's the mechanic. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, Hood's back. Oh my god. <gasps> no! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that looks so good. Oh my god. <laughs> oh! Okay, give me a minute. I need a breather. That was so good. Right, so let's analyze this. Now, I'm assuming that this, this ship we see here, is the same one from um, the teaser trailer, the one that blows up. I'll put that little clip in, uh, just like just up there or something. And um, yeah, that's the one that blows up, I reckon. Let's move on. Yeah, we look, look, see, it blows up. I forgot about that. Right, so that shot there, that's clearly of Scott, I think. And I think that's Ko Scott and Ko I think. Like their feet, and then that's Lady, and that's the uh, FAB one with Lady Penelope and Parker running away from what looks like some kind of giant mole. Oh, and then we've got this. What is that thing? That looks like something that the mechanic has clearly built to like destroy, but just to give you a sense of scale, right? So we had that building there, right? That giant thing that's a GDF like plane and then look how big that thing is jesus right move on oh so this looks like some kind of core this looks similar to the um similar to the one um the one from heavy metal the big reactor core oh there's um oh i've forgotten his name um ned that was his name ned right okay so yeah, Ned's clearly back, which I'm not a huge fan of because I didn't really like Ned in the series. I thought they played him once and I was like, yeah, it's kind of funny. And then they used him as a reoccurring gag, which I didn't like, I'll be honest. So sorry. If you liked him, more power to you. I just don't like him. Oh, okay. So we had, okay, we're going to have to slow down there because there were so many things in that frame. So there's, there's Parker, uh, Penelope and Ko. That was some sort of hatch. And there you go, that's the shot that we want to look at. The old International Rescue hat. Now, obviously I'm a sucker for it because I watched the original series. That hit me, hits me right here. But, it's kind of annoying because the people who didn't watch the original will have no idea. Who, people who didn't watch it like in the 1990s or the 1960s will have no idea what that hat is. So, that's kind of annoying. But I'm glad they're giving a bit of fan service to the OG fans. So, thank you very much. ITV, I really appreciate that. And then that goes away, right back to normal speed. I happen to know what's coming. 
There's Thunderbird 3. Oh, and that looks, that's like similar to the, um, what's it called, where they go towards the sun. Uh, where they, oh, coincidentally, first time they try and rescue Ned, that one. Next. Yeah, we've seen this shot in the other trailer where Thunderbird 3 flies away from what I thought was Stone... I think it is Stonehenge. No, it's not Stonehenge. I don't know why I thought it was Stonehenge. Um, and clearly... Oh my god, is this on Mars? It might be. It, might, it could potentially be on Mars because it's in space. I'm going to stand by that theory and say that this is on Mars. Oh, there he is again. Oh, okay, so we had a few shots there. Hold on. Okay, so that's a house blowing up. And you got to remember, they're doing actual live action sets. So they're actually blowing stuff up. That looks like an ice mold kind of thing. And we've got Thunderbird 3 in the background. Oh, what was that? I look like... That's clearly another thing that the mechanics built. It's like a robot. And then that's John, that's Scott. Ah, here we go. Here's our first shot of um, the mechanic and uh, the Thunderbird talking together. I reckon this will be on the first episode of season two, similar to how the Hood uh, contacted them at the end of episode one from series one, Ring of Fire. Um, so yeah, I reckon he'll be on it. Moving on. Okay, so the mechanic is he's got a voice disguise. Actually, oh my god, I've had a just a really interesting theory. So, look at brains, right? This isn't me trying to be like stereotype or anything, but look at brains and then look at the mechanic. Both of them have the same skin color. They're both very smart. They both know how to invent things. Is it possible that the mechanic could be the br could be brains' brother or a family relative of some kind? I think I think he's a relative. I think he has some connection to international rescue. Because the hood had a connection with Chaos. I mean, he always has had that, like uh, in the original show uh, and in the 2004 movie. <laughs> we must always forget. So yeah, they've always had that connection, and it will be more the mechanics character will be more impactful if he actually has a connection to the character. So I reckon he's brains his brother. I'm putting that theory out as well. Okay, so that's a shot of Gordon, Penelope, Parker, that just sitting there. Yeah. Um, oh, look, there's the thing again from the beginning of the trailer. So it's clearly, it's clearly just a gigantic drill. And that is what was chasing Lady Penelope and Parker in the, in the tunnels. So that will be... Um, yeah, yeah, so that's, that's clearly what that is. Okay, so Chaos holding off the edge. <gasps> this! This is what I want to talk about. So, is this suggesting that Jeff Tracy is coming back? I know this was in the teaser trailer, and I know Sam covered this, but this was really interesting when I saw this. I jumped out of my chair, so excited. So, this clearly has something to do with Jeff Tracy, which I'm really happy about. And if they bring him back, I hopefully... I mean, if they bring him back, that'll be great. But again, similar to the hat, OG fans won't know what that's about. They'll be like, oh, he's, who's Jeff Tracy? They won't, it won't be as impactful. But for people like me and Sam, mind blown. It'll be so good. Okay, so this is John's clearly got a new uh, pod. Green button, bro. <laughs> I like that line. And then Thunderbird 1 is smoking. And it's, okay. So clearly it's just for, oh yeah, there's that bit later on where he falls. So clearly this is like coming off. From that, and there's a shot later on I really want to talk about as well. Parker kicking down the door, mechanic again. He takes what he wants. Uh, there's another family, uh, family member, and then look, look at that. What's that about? Oh, that's weird. Oh, is he like a robot now? Oh, that. Oh yeah, he could be. Could be like a. It could be a fake because the real. Ooh. Could it be that the one that went to jail is a fake? Possibly. Or is he just a robot? I really hope the hood's not a robot. That'll be so disappointing. I cause cause he's gotta be a relative to KO, so there's gotta be a real one. 
Okay, so that's Gordon. That's the mechanic. Okay, it's one of those five. Uh, several things blowing up. This! This is what I wanted to talk about. So Thunderbird 2 has clearly crash-landed back on, um, what is it? Tracy Island. And that is, um, what is it? That's clearly inspired by that episode from, um, from the original series. Uh, Trouble in New York City, I think, or Crisis in New York City. Where um, at the beginning of the episode, Thunderbird 2 gets shot down and it crash lands back on Tracy Island. I'm glad they're doing that. But again, fan service. Not original fans will know, but I'm glad that... No, original fans will know even. And I'm glad that I do. Other fans won't. They'll just find it interesting that it's crashing. It's pretty cool. But very happy. Oh yeah, and this is what I was talking about earlier. So Thunderbird 1 is clearly going to fall. It's not going to crash because we saw that scene earlier where it's going to go and it's just going to carry on flying. So when you're watching this episode, don't get to... Because we know he's going to be alright, because we've seen the footage, so... But that's still a really cool shot of it falling from the sky. It looks very similar to Heavy Metal when it's falling with the um, plane that looks like the Fire Flash. And there we go, Thunderbirds Are Go Season 2 trailer. Very nice, very nice indeed. So, what did I think of it? Well, I thought it was... I thought it was really interesting. Like... That was a really good trailer, and um, there's definitely I've made all the points I want to make on it. Really like it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want more analysis videos like this in the future, well, I don't really know what I'm going to analyze, but if say uh, send me something you might want me to look at, I'll do it because I do do genuine reactions, not like um, certain YouTubers who you know I'm not going to throw shade because we know how that goes now. But yeah, I'll actually do genuine reactions and then analysis. I'll just watch the video and then say goodbye in silence. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this. I will see you next video. Goodbye. Oh my god, this is actually really exciting. Oh, come on, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I need it. I need it. I need it. Oh my god. It's not on yet. I'm really annoyed because it's 12 o'clock and I want the trailer. Come on, you promise. You promise, Thunderbird. You put a tweet out. You put several tweets out saying it'd be 12 o'clock.